everyone is buzzing with excitement. Buzz is here. Introducing first, from parts unknown, weighing in at 220 pounds, the hero. Every superstar has a goal in WWE, and Bud told me he's aiming high with his. He wants to have a career that one day is recognized with a spot in the WWE Hall of Fame. It's way too premature to start that discussion, but his career is definitely trending in the right direction for that to at least be possible. Your paranoia is probably worse. I don't know what certainly offers, but I know what I can't stand. Everybody acts the fact of the matter because I can't add up to what you can, but everybody has a face that they hold inside. Face that awakes when I close my eyes. Face that watches every time they lie. Face that laughs every time they fall. So you know that when it's time to sink or swim. Welcome to Balor Club. Superstar the world over. Finn Balor seems to get better, faster, stronger, and more dangerous every single week in WWE. Superstar, a phenomenon amongst the WWE Universe. Finn Balor posted on social media earlier today that Balor Club is for everyone. Here we go, guys. Tag team action is underway. And I can't help but get the feeling that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly.
a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. Oh, what impact! technique Drop kick with precision dash wilder on some offense now Damn. it's no secret that quick tags lead to success in the tag team division and i'd say the quicker he can make that tag here the better their chances of winning will be tag team history was made when the first ever smackdown tag team champions were crowned at backlash 2016 the unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the tag team title tournament. In the finals, Rhino and Slater took on the Usos to see which team would be the inaugural tag team champions. Harsh impact! There was a lot on the line in the tag team tournament finals. The Usos wanted to add another tag team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown tag team champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was the team no one expected to be in the finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and Heath Slater refused to lose. After a gore from Rhino practically cut Jimmy Uso in half, Rhino and Heath Slater went from an unlikely tag team to the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Never say never in WWE is absolutely right. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rivalry between these women got so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalia's... Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. Oh, drop kick. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. I don't think he should get up. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Dash Wilder. His aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, he got the shoulders down. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Oh, wow. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Nailed it. What does Buzz have in store? We got a, what an exploder. But did he go for it too early? When this guy's on, look out. This might be it. Oh, my. He's got the shoulders down. Kicks out on a pinball attempt. Yeah, he's not done yet. Wilder got out of there just in time. Barely. Dash Wilder's in serious trouble. Is there anything that can be done to get back to being a threat? His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. Boom! <laughs> Looks like he's starting to tire. 
This tag team match is dangerously close to getting out of control for him. Why he's still in the match at this point is beyond me, guys. Oh, man. Maybe he forgot it's a tag team match. I don't know. There's got to be some explanation. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some Ooh. time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. Ooh! Ooh, what impact! Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way! And off the tag is Finn Balor. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, what a close line. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Wilder's looking to finish this. This just ain't going to do it. It's a reversal. No person could take much more of this and Dash Wilder is not looking good. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this tag team match. Oh no, this isn't going to end well. Oh my God, Surfer leg breaker. He's making a statement here with this attack. Boom, what impact. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. He's too quick for him there. What are they going to do here? Closing moments, maybe this match. you got to believe this one's over. Wilder looking in control here. That's what his shoulders are down. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. Boom! Dalton takes out the knee. Uh-oh. Here's his chance to win this. Oh! Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh, right in the face. Destroyed. how much he has left. He leaves no doubt right there. The Irishman has his Irish up. Oh, boom! Oh, oh, swept the leg right out from under. Wisely bringing the action back into the ring. Oh, Dawson, just too fast for him. Go at the front. Oh. Inverted figure four apply. Oh, Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. But now, can Scott Dawson capitalize? What a stop! Good grief! There's the cover, can he do it? He breaks up the pin, and Corey, the match continues! I love it! Beautiful technique! Heavy duty right hand, and that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. Boom! What a kick! Uh-oh! In position. Look out! Here it comes! Oh, almost through the turnbuckle. Finn Balor never ceases to amaze me. And now Finn Balor heads up. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Who did Ross? It's not Scott Dawson. That should do it. Harsh impact to think. I almost wrote him off earlier. What an incredible tag team contest. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well.
guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Here are your winners, the hero, Anson Feller. Nice teamwork by these two here tonight. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest, being pinned is humiliating. Social media has been buzzing over this Raw match ever since it began, and now that it's over, I actually anticipated it intensifying.